You will be surprised to know that reticulospinal tract is actually the hidden helper after stroke. You must have experienced this in post-stroke recovery that the arm is stuck in flexed synergy and the leg in extensor synergy pattern. Now, what's the way out of it? Here are the medial and lateral reticulospinal tracts, which originate from the pontomedullary junction, which control gross motor functions and muscle tone in body. And these are the descending motor pathways, which are damaged due to stroke. Now, in absence of these motor tracts, reticulospinal tracts can take over their function through corticoreticular fibers. And due to poor training, these tracks leads to unbalanced tone in the hemiplegic side. So to gain fine motor control, right training is needed for the reticulospinal tracks. But the question is how to train reticulospinal tracks for fine motor movements after stroke. This can be achieved by understanding the concepts of functional re-education techniques, the use of head and neck PNF patterns, the perceptual motor control training, and the sensory motor training concepts. All of these are covered in detail in our premium membership for only 89 rupees a month. If you are interested to learn, join now.